Mosley being able to elevate over the defender, use the soft touch. He's got a dozen. Anthony. Look at that scrap for the rebound. Body sprawling out. I think they're going to get Wagner for the foul. And now a technical foul. As Wagner and Okoro now trying to exchange some words. And then the officials will separate and sort it out. The tech is called on Isaac Okoro. For that bump and then the shove after the play as both guys were heading back to midcourt. Well, you see, just a closeout, getting in yep. a stance. And then forces the turnover. Niang, bodied by Fultz in a foul, and now George is yapping. And uh, sharing some of his sentiments with the Orlando bench as well. Remnants of last year's physical first rounder with the New York Knickerbockers. It's the playoffs. Physicality goes to another level. Marco Fultz just trying to get in front. Bodies. George Niang took some exception. You bring in some toughness. Yeah, you, you weren't as physical as you wanted to be. You weren't shooting at it. Yeah. You know, that's the other part. The wind up, which is the acceleration by the defender into the dribbler, is unnecessary contact, which leads to a second foul on the run. Following the dead ball contact, there is a dead ball technical foul on George Niang for taunting. And then one shot for Orlando, anybody in the game. And then we will shoot two shots for George Niang for the flagrant. So both reviews go Cleveland's way, but both technicals also go Cleveland's way. Yeah, and, and you can see from that angle a little bit different than the, the rear camera angle that we saw, the lowering of the shoulder, 